Yee-hee-hee-hee-hee! <laughs> I've finally done it! And this time, it's a foolproof plan! Luna Girl, you and me are once and for all gonna take down the PJ Masks! I just have to take my Electrode... Wait a minute, where's my Electrode? Found it! Now my Electrode is programmed to shrink things! Observe! I can take the biggest object, like my mobile lab, and Zeppo! <laughs> it now becomes super small! And just like this miniature mobile lab, I'll do the same to those PJ Masks! But we're gonna need a diversion! And that's where you come in! Go to the PJ Masks headquarters! And when they least expect it, they'll be shrunk! <laughs> now go! Whoa, Lionel, you're flying and wait a minute, that doesn't make much sense. You can't fly, you're a lizard. Hmm, something doesn't seem right here. Wait a minute, who's that over there? Oh no, it's Luna Girl! I better go tell Connor! Ah, uh, Connor! A uh, Luna Girl has somehow found her way into the PJMS headquarters! D Luna Girl? Uh, that's not good! We must tell Amaya! Uh, Amaya! A Luna Girl has somehow found her way into our headquarters! To stop, we gotta transform into the PJ Masks! Come on! Uh, once we transform, we'll easily be able to stop Luna Girl! Yeah, but let's just get into our transformation chambers quickly! Hehehehe! <laughs> ah, Luna Girl has done very well! And while the PJ Masks transform, I'll be busy shrinking them! <laughs> <laughs> and worked and worked. Now the PJ Masks are stuck in this tiny headquarters. Hey, hey, uh, what's going on? Why'd my room shrink? And uh, Gecko, I think your foot is in my face. Huh? Your face is on my foot. Uh, get off! Ow! Ow! <laughs> Enjoy your small space while I take over the world. Hey, hey, was that Romeo's voice? Who was that? I don't know, can you just move? Job well done, Luna Girl. You can put Gecko's pet down now. Meek, 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 meek. Yeah, I guess with the PJ Masks out of the way, I can set my headquarters up in here. But first things first, I'm gonna need my computer! Ah, perfect spot for it! Yeah, I'll just put my electrode away over here, and I can get to work! Now I just have to come up with a plan without the PJ Masks of taking over the world! Hmm, shouldn't be too hard! I think I've got an idea! I just have to program my electrode and... Hey, wait a minute! Where's the electrode? I put it right here! Make me make me. Hey, and Lionel the Gecko has it! Uh, come here, Lionel! That thing's important! Yeah! Nick, 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 Nick. I should have caged that pet when I had the chance. Uh oh. 
Mick, 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 no, no, a Luna girl, stop that gecko! Mick, Mick, Mick. Ah, and this is a huge problem! Whew, glad to be out of there! Now let's get Luna Girl! And we gotta get Romeo! Hey Romeo, remember me? Hiya! Oh no, uh, what are you gonna do? Huh, you'll see! Uh, take it away, Lionel! Mick, 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 mick. <laughs> it's a little tight in here. Luna girl, move your foot! A couple weeks in here ought to chill him out. Uh, maybe we should put this in our trophy room. Hey, thanks for watching. Now, some of the toys featured in the video come from this PJ Masks collectible figures kind of blind bag set. And so this is like almost series two of the PJ Masks blind bag. So check it out. We've got a whole box of them. Whoa. And these are cool because look at the cases that they come in. It's like a little headquarters. So we've got tons of them here. We're gonna open up a couple of them today, but got a whole box full of them. So this is super fun. PJ Masks collectible figures. Now let's get started with opening this first one here. And uh, I'm not sure how we are gonna open it. Oh, I guess we just peel it down. So this is cool. They've got the PJ Masks logo on here. I just wanna show you one of these cases really quick. So yeah, a little headquarters, you see this, so you got the outlet symbol, catboy symbol, and the gecko symbol. And uh, I think it's a cool case. The case itself is even worth keeping. And da -da -da -da, our first one that we have is Catboy. Let's, hold on. Let's check this out. Catboy looks super awesome. And Catboy has his awesome sword here. Now these are just figurines, collectible figures. They uh, don't have any points of articulation, I meaning they can't move at all, so they're just nice little figurines that you can put on your mantle or wherever you want to put your PJ Masks collectibles. So it shows Catboy pointing out to the distance. Look, it's almost like the uh, uh, Babe Ruth calling out his shot. So he's pointing this way, and then he's going to hit a huge home run with his sword. No, just kidding. So here is his awesome uh, sword that he has. He is in the standing position, like he's ready to fight like Catboy, or not Catboy, but ready to fight Night Ninja or Rome or little girl like hey yeah 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 all right so here is our first one okay on to number two pj mask collectibles Let's see what we have here and uh when i first ripped it open the first time that seemed pretty easy okay it goes along down this line so when you get this it, it's along this line right here that you can easily tear it open so you don't need to use scissors which is good we don't want kids to have scissors and stuff there's the cool case again. I just really like the cases. So here we have, oh, look at this. This is Lionel the Lizard. This is Gecko's little lizard. Gecko as well, super happy little guy. Now we have seen these before, and this is in like a, a larger play set, but uh, Lionel looks really cool. Got a little, little four feet here, let's see. Oh, it stands up pretty well, a little wobbly, but uh, otherwise stands up uh, really, really well. And uh, happy little lizard. And, and again, for these being blind, I think there's too much details on them. You can see all of his scales. He's got the big bulging eyes, smiley and happy. Got all of the, uh, the, the ridge here. He is ready to go. Okay. Blind, uh, can't, I guess we can't even call these blind bags because they're not really bags, are they? They're more like blind buckets or boxes or something like that. But let's see, there are 12 that we can collect. So hopefully we don't get any, any duplicates here. We do not want duplicates and oh, look what we have here. It is Romeo, the main villain of the PJ Masks. And Romeo, look how happy he is. 
So he's got this thing here. I've never been able to find out what this is called. I call it an electrode. It's like a, a remote. I, I, I think it's uh, some giant remote that he uses to um, I don't know, control things or whatever. So here is this. Now it's actually cut off because in the show there's like one extra piece that goes along here. So there's four different little prongs. There's three here. It's probably just so it can fit against his head a little bit easier. But Romeo looks pretty cool. Let me know in the comments, by the way, if you know why Romeo has like some white hair right here. If he did that himself, or if he was naturally born with it or something, or some other reason. He's got his little backpack, his gloves on and everything, and he is ready to go. Okay, so let's open up. We've got three, you know what, I'm gonna put these in, in the background. Let's see, we actually have one, two, even though you can't see them, I'm just gonna put them in the background. Three right here. And this was opened up uh, previously. Uh, a little baby opened this one up and he wanted to play with it. But this is Greg. And Greg is doing something with his hands. He's holding his wrist like that. But uh, Greg is the alter ego of Gecko. So when he's not in his PJ masks uh, uh, outfit. He is just regular Greg. You can see though he's still got the green eyes, he's got the, the green other PJs I guess, green slippers and everything. So this is a cool uh, uh, set as well, or figure as well. So we've got four of them. Let's see if we can find any more without getting duplicates. Let's see here, just got a peel right here. We will find out what this is. I think you want to peel this whole thing off and you can keep all the cases. These cases are super cool. Okay, and here we go. All right. So now we have a Gecko or a Greg. We've got Catboy and we have Owlet here. What's funny is this uh, package, it's harder to open than the actual little bucket there. So, Alem looks super cool. She's in like a, a fighting stance just like uh, Catboy was. But uh, looks like she's ready to take a stance. Hiya! Just like that. She's in some sort of ninja, ninja pose there. So, uh, she's got the cape on the back. And this cape, unlike her other ones, the silicone ones, this cape is not movable, really. But it's, it's like a matte paint or whatever, so it's not shiny. Um, but she looks super cool, you know, obviously ready to take on any villains who try to ruin hers or the, the PJ Masks uh, night. And then she's got, of course, the uh, owl face and the red eyes and everything. Okay, let's open up one more and let's hope that we don't have a duplicate. And then we'll have all, we'll have six of the 12 and uh, we'll open up the other ones in in another video. I'll let you know when that is. And of course, the last one we're gonna open, it's gonna be really, really hard to open. Oh, here we go. All right, gonna rip this. Okay, let's see. Oh, we got our duplicate, our first duplicate. This is Catboy again with his little, with his little sword. So now we have twin cat boys with all of uh, with his with his sword here. Here's one, and here's two. So they can be little twins. Like, hey, hey, you're talking to me? No, I'm talking to you. Are you sure? Am I looking to a mirror? I don't know. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the Toys Review Toys channel. Now, let me know in the comments, since we've opened up a lot of figures, what of these figures do you like best? Is it Greg? Is it Lionel, his gecko? Is it Outlet, Catboy, or is it Romeo? Or do you just like the case in general? Is the case super cool? Let me know. And then tap or click on a picture to watch another fun video. Have a great day.